Welcome back to my channel Code with Neha. So today I am back with another interesting topic. Hope you all will like it. So without any further delay, let's get started. So in my previous video, I have discussed about primary key constraints in MySQL. Today's topic is foreign key constraint in MySQL. Foreign key constraint is used to prevent action that would destroy links between tables. A foreign key is a field or collection of fields in one table that refers to the primary key in another table. The table with the foreign key is called the child table and the table with the primary key is called the referenced or parent table. So let's look at an example to understand it better. Here we have two tables. One is the orders table, another is the customers table. In orders table, there is order details and in customers table, we have the customers details. So, let us consider order ID as the primary key of orders table and customer ID in customers table as primary key. Both the table have a similar column that is the customer ID. So, customer ID will be the foreign key in orders table and primary key in customers table. The foreign key constraint prevents invalid data from being inserted into the foreign key column because it has to be one of the values contained in the parent table. So, let's look into the syntaxes of foreign key. It's almost similar to the syntax of primary key, but it also has a command called references. So, what's the purpose of references? Basically, references refers to the primary key of another table. It gives reference of one table to another table. Let us apply in MySQL database. First, creating a database called Persons. Then, using the database with the command use persons. Creating first table persons as parent table.
followed by creation of second table orders as child table note that syntax of both the table is similar but in the orders table person id is the foreign key with references to the primary key person id of persons table Here we have successfully created two tables with the help of primary key and foreign key. So that's all for today. I hope this content will help you all. If it's so, then don't forget to subscribe my channel Code with Neha and press the bell icon to never miss an update. I will be back soon with another interesting topic. Till then, stay tuned to the channel.